What is the benefit of cash count to the business owners? In cash count, there will be a transparency in the financial flow of the business. First is cash deposit, cash pickup, cash count, and zero reading after cash count done by the supervisor or manager to verify if the cashier is short or over with the money. These features will help your business big time. So first click cash count and you will see here cash deposit. So cash deposit is for petty cash or the cash fund the cashier uses for customer exchange. So for example, 2000. Cash deposit is done upon logging in in the POS or the start shift of the cashier. Click save. And now as you can see, it is saved successfully. Now I'm going to show you a sales transaction and Gcash transaction. So, for example, alcohol. Select. And let's say the customer purchased Save the tender. Select the customer payment amount. Tender. Now, next for a GCAS transaction. Again, example alcohol. Proceed to tender. Choose the payment type. Select GCash. And then tender sales. So here, you will input the last four digit in the information on your GCash. So for example, let's say, and you can also input the name of the customer. And proceed. Tender sales, tender. Click OK. You will also see here the Gcash and the name of the customer. So let's say during the shift of the cashier, the owner will do a cash pickup. So what is cash pickup? Just click cash count. You will see here cash pickup. So cash pickup is when the owner or the manager will get money from the cash drawer for possible payments or for safety purposes. So for example, 100 for payment. Click save. And save successfully. Now let's say the shift of the cashier will end and they will now do the cash count. So we will enter the cash here in denomination and also the value of the Gcash that we did earlier. So, for example, 1, 500 pesos, 2, 100 pesos, 150 pesos, and 2, 20 pesos. So you will see here the cash count. Now for our Gcash transaction, the Gcash value, 400, and Print and end shift. Also, don't forget to check the draw cash count. Now you will see here the cash count. And lastly, Z reading that is done after cash count. The owner or the manager will verify if the cashier is short or under with the money. Just click Control Shift Z and click OK. And you will see here the Gcash transaction. We are short 1 pesos. And here on our sales, we are short.
can also go to back office, click reports, click sales Z reading, select the terminal, and click display. You can also see here the Z reading, and you can print it again. And that's it for this video. If you have further questions or concerns, you can message us on Facebook or call us on your company number. Now, if you want to boost your business, choose Big Boss.